Please pause for a moment of silence. Please stand for the pledges. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now for the Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to thee, Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. We hope all of you had a wonderful three-day memorial weekend spent honoring those who risked their lives for our freedom. But now that we're back and only have nine days of school and two NHS TV shows left, we've got a recap of Friday's car giveaway. And we take a look at some movies coming out this summer at Harkins Theaters in Southlake that you won't want to miss. Stay tuned, NHS TV starts right now. The Black Box production of Radium Girls will kick off this week starting tonight at 7 p.m. Show dates and times include tonight at 7, tomorrow at 7, Saturday at 7, and Sunday at 2. This is sure to be a great show, so come out and support your fellow Texans. Tomorrow at 4 p.m. in the library, the literary magazine will be released. Be sure to come out and check out the awesome work done by Creative Writing Club. All netbooks returns will be taking place during your English classes. Seniors return theirs today, juniors tomorrow, sophomores Thursday, and freshmen Friday. If you weren't at the car giveaway last Friday, you sure did miss out. Here's a look at what happened when Northwest, Byron, and Steele took a trip to the Texas Motor Speedway where one lucky student won a new car. It's that time of year again, and since most of you were present and accounted for, we're going to make this quick. The car giveaway went off without a hitch, just like it does every year. 25 names were drawn, 13 of which came from Northwest High School. But this year was a little different from all the rest. A sophomore from Byron Nelson High School took home the car. It's unreal. Like, I can't even believe it. But don't be too upset, Texans. I think Ms. Parker says it best. Like I've told every kid who didn't win the car, we're all winners. And so it's just a, a great opportunity. And yes, I'm ecstatic. For those of you students who will be at Northwest next year, you have another chance, so good luck. For the rest of you, some things just aren't meant to be. For probably the last time ever for NHS TV, I'm Annalene Priest. Congratulations to all of this year's winners. Thanks to Marit Chevrolet, Dell, Hawaiian Falls, and the Texas Motor Speedway for being amazing sponsors of this year's event. Speaking of the Texas Motor Speedway, make sure to come out to the Speedway on June 14th for Friday Night Drags. It's your favorite summer pastime. Friday Night Drags presented by Scion is back. For six Friday nights starting June 14th through July 26th, you can drag race your own car down pit road, show it off in the show and shine competition, take it for a cruise around the track during the parade lap, or just hang out in the grandstands. Texas Motor Speedway is the hottest spot in town and cheapest to spend your Friday nights this summer. You won't want to miss this. Our very own principal, Mr. Childress, will be drag racing Miss Parker on June 14th at the Texas Motor Speedway. Don't miss this amazing event. You can purchase these tickets at the Texas Motor Speedway box office. If you've got nothing exciting planned this summer or are just looking for some good entertainment, here's a look at all the movies coming out this summer at Harkins Theaters in Southlake. 2013 is a summer of sequels. Theaters are filling up with highly anticipated movies as well as some you may not know about. Listen up, you moviegoers. This is going to be big. <laughs> Very funny Monsters Solomon University, the highly publicized prequel of the 2001 movie Monsters, Inc., shows the lives of Mike and Sully before their friendship began. It's set to hit theaters June 21st. Gru and the girls, along with the minions, are back in Despicable Me 2, out July 5th. Oh, Despicable Me. Grown Ups 2 is out on July 12th, and Smurfette is in danger in the Smurfs 2, out August 2nd. 
2013's new heartthrob, Logan Lerman, is back to star as Percy Jackson in the sequel, Sea of Monsters, August 9th. Marvel and DC are making sure to leave an impact this summer by adding new sequels to popular franchises. Red 2 is being released July 19th. Man of Steel hits theaters on June 14th and is the next Superman movie since Superman Returns in 2006. And Hugh Jackman continues his role in The Wolverine, which is being released on July 26th. Now let's take a look at other movies coming out this summer. Vince Vaughn and Owen Wilson get a job at Google in The Internship, out June 7th. Seth Rogen's new movie, This is the End, is out June 14th. Pacific Rim comes to theaters July 12th. And the film of the best-selling novel, The Moral Instrument, City of Bones, comes out August 23rd. British boy band One Direction have stolen hearts and completed world tours. Now, they're hitting theaters in the United States with their summer documentary about how they became the world's newest sensation, August 30th. This week's trivia question is, what is Superman's birth given name? Tweet your answer to at NHS TV for a chance to win two free Harkins movie tickets. And don't forget to bring your student ID to Harkins Theaters in Southlake for discount pricings at the box. Have a fantastic summer Texans and I'll see you next year. Live while we are. Be sure to stay tuned to our very last show of the year tomorrow where we pay contribute to our seniors. And Carrie takes the streets one last time for the final Texas on Main Street of the year. Have a terrific Tuesday, Texans.